Martindale provide a number of devices for detecting the presence of voltages, currents and magnetic fields, ideal for general fault finding or tracing the roots of cables. It is however vital that you select the detector with an appropriate voltage range and sensitivity. This is printed on each device with further information on the user guide. For some applications, a single pole contact indicator, like the VT7, may be the best solution. The TEC 100, 101 and 200 are non-contact detectors with built-in proving capability. But it's worth mentioning that these should not be used as part of a safe isolation procedure. The built-in self-test of the TEC series checks the sensor at 50 Hz, the battery and LED. A great solution ensuring reliable results every time. The TEC 100 will detect the presence of voltages ranging between 100 and 600 volts and is CAT4 safety rated to 600 volts as well. The TEC 200 is also between 100 and 600 volts with a CAT4 rating of 600 volts. But this device has the additional capability to detect the presence and polarity of magnetic fields produced by relays, solenoids and transformers. The TEC 101 will detect the presence of voltages between 180 and 600 volts, but has a CAT4 rating of 1000 volts. This product has an extended probe tip for accessing conductors in confined spaces, and its sensitivity has been optimised for discriminating between adjacent conductors at close range. Next we have the VT7, a single pole contact detector which is designed for testing in situations where other indicators may not work so reliably. For example, where the user has to wear PPE, which may inhibit the natural leakage of some current to earth that other devices rely on. The VT7 is rated to CAT4 300 volts and CAT3 600 volts. Although the self-test checks the functionality and battery, a proving check on a known live source should be performed prior to use.